welcome to your writing session with Mrs. Wilding. Today we are going to talk about opinion writing. Is it what I think or is it what I know? For this session you will need a pen or a pencil and a piece of paper. First we are going to look at the difference between a fact and an opinion. An opinion is what you think or how you feel about something. It cannot be proven. People can have different opinions. Sam might say, I like pizza. Becky might say, I don't like pizza. It's a personal preference. A fact is the opposite. A fact is something that can be proven. We can share our opinions with others by writing about them. Here's some sentence sorters you might use in opinion writing. I think, I like, or my favorites. Let's see if you can spot the difference between a fact and an opinion. After reading the sentence, pause your video. Note down if you think this is a fact or an opinion. I love cats because they are so cute. Fact or opinion. Trees provide oxygen. Fact or opinion. I think roses are the prettiest flowers, fact or opinion. Let's see how you did. If you said that I love cats because they are so cute is an opinion, you were correct. If you said trees provide oxygen is a fact, you were correct. If you said I think roses are the prettiest flowers is an opinion, you were correct. Now you give it a try. Pause your video for a few minutes and write down some opinions that comes to mind. Remember to use opinion words like I think my favorite, I like, the best or in my opinion. After writing your opinions, please reread them and check them to make sure that they are opinions, something that you feel something that you like. Right, let's see what is your task for today. Today you can choose any topic that you feel really passionate about. It might be your favorite TV show, a book that you really enjoy, a sport that you like doing, a hobby that you would like to learn, already know how to do, yummy food or anything that sparks your interest. I chose to do my opinion writing about my favorite pet. I started off by doing a brainstorm. In the middle, I wrote down that I think that dogs make the best pets. Then I noted down four good reasons why I say dogs make the best pets. I wrote down that they are very playful, that they are great companions, they are very active. And they learn you how to take responsibility for something. After my brainstorm, I'm going to start with my opinion writing. I'm going to start by asking a question. Are you a dog owner? Then I'm going to answer my own question, stating my opinion. If you are, you probably already know just how awesome dogs are. I'm going to then back up my opinion with a reason. They fill your life with love, loyalty, fear and plenty to smile about. In my second paragraph, I'm going to combine my other reasons for choosing dogs. Dogs are the best because they love you unconditionally. Owing a dog can help kids learn about responsibility and empathy. Dogs make the best workout partners. They'll motivate you to get up and take them for a walk. They have amazing athletic skills. They love to snuggle and they're the best at it. Every day is an adventure when you share your life with a dog. In my ending, I just state my opinion for the last time. Let's look at some tips and reminders before you start writing. Remember to brainstorm your ideas. Use some opinion words when you write. Start your sentences with capital letters. Feel free to draw a picture when you are done. And please remember to share your writing.